Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial, I will show you how to recover your Wondershare Filmora project. So like always, first of all, we need to open Filmora and then make sure that you are logged into your account. So always, that happens to everyone this thing with you are working on some kind of project, you've done a lot of editing, as you can see here, for example, you add colors, you add stuff, music, etc. And you really don't have the time to finish it. So what you'll do basically is save it as a project and then you will like complete it later. Well, how you can actually find that project and how you can like continue working on it without losing, losing anything. So. Let's add something here, for example, so we can see that is uh, everything we add is existing. So let's add the color here and yeah, something like that. And now what I'm going to do is basically you can just click on the top in here, save. And here you choose where do you want it to be. So for me, I want it to be in document, Wondershare, Wondershare Femora project. So here I will name it VE project two and click on save. All right, now if I close this page and I close this and I reopen my Filmora, there is basically two ways to be able to see your project. The first one, which is recovering your project basically from this page, which is the instant mode project. So here they will open for our latest project that we were, we were working on. So if we clicked on it, double click it will be opening with all the layers that we have worked on. So here you can see, this is the video, this is the music, and this is the titles that you have added, and also the colors have been changed. The second thing, you can just go straight ahead to your files. So let's go to, for example, this PC. So I'm going to direct this here. Now what I'm going to do is go to document. From document, we go to Filmora. So let's under share and under share Filmora. And then here we go to project and here it is. This is my project. So if I click on it, double click, here it is, and that's how I can recover it really simply. So yeah guys, that was it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and thank you for watching.